Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to install Google Play on the all new Amazon Fire 8 HD. Now this will work on the Amazon Fire 7 and the Fire 10, but some of the links will have to be changed. I'll leave everything in the description. Mainly I'm going to be focusing on the newer tablet, the Fire HD 8. So recently the HD 8 was on sale for $50 on Amazon. It usually goes on sale every once in a while. I'll leave links in the description if you're interested in picking one up. It's a good tablet but you can make it even better by adding Google Play. So this is gonna give us access to the full Google Play Store and we can install pretty much any app we want. By doing this, you won't lose any data that's already on your tablet. It's just gonna add Google Play and we can start installing our favorite applications. So with that out of the way, let's go ahead and get started. All right, so let's go ahead and install Google Play. You will have to have an internet connection to do this because we need to download four APKs, but first we need to turn on unknown sources. So we're gonna head up here and go to settings. We're gonna find security. And from here, apps from unknown sources. We're gonna turn this on. You're gonna get a little warning, click okay. And now we can install third-party apps. We're gonna head back to the main menu and in the description of this video, there are four links. You need to install these in order. They are numbered in the description. We're gonna open the Silk browser. The first one is the Google Account Manager. It needs to be the exact one in the description. Then Google Services Framework, Google Play Services, and finally, Google Play Store. So make sure you download these in order and install them in order. First up, Google Account Manager. We're gonna scroll down here and just click on Download APK. Give it a few seconds. If it does not download automatically, there is a Next button at the very bottom, but you should get something like this. Click Download. When it's finished, click Open and Install. So number one is out of the way. Next up, Google Services Framework. Same thing, download APK. Wait for it to prompt us to download. Click download. Open. Install. Done. Number three. Google Play Services. Download APK. Wait for the download prompt to show up. Click download. Some of these are bigger than others. Open. Install. Done. And finally, Google Play Store. Scroll down. Download APK. Wait for the prompt. OK. Open install click done and now we can go back to the main menu we have google play installed but first things first let's go ahead and do a reboot just hold your power button on the top of the unit and restart now that we've restarted the tablet we can scroll down and open up google play looks like the old icon that's okay it'll update itself after we sign in it's going to check the info and all we need to do is sign in with a gmail account like we would with an android phone or an android tablet it's going to prompt us to enter our email. Just go ahead and click on the clear box. Your keyboard will pop up. Type in your email, then your password. Then we're signed into Google Play. I just signed in. I usually turn back up off. Click accept and Google Play will shut down because it's updating itself. The app icon just changed. Now what I do from here is wait about three minutes because it needs to update the Google libraries also. So I just set the tablet down for three to five minutes and let it finish updating. But after a few minutes, I just open up Google Play and I can now download my favorite apps. I'm just gonna go ahead and demo it real quick. I'm gonna download FR Legends, really awesome little drift game. It's gonna download and install to the tablet. All we need to do is launch it. So that's it guys. It's really easy to install Google Play on your Amazon Fire 8 tablet. This will also work on the 7, but you will need a different link. I'm going to link it down below. Um, just one of the apps needs to be different from the one we just installed on the Fire 8. It'll be listed in the description. Really appreciate you guys watching. If you're interested in picking one of these up, I'm going to leave links to Amazon in the description. 
Like always, thanks for watching.